Hi guys, hope everyone is doing really well. I think this is number five, if I'm not mistaken, but I probably am. Um, I've just met a guy called Darren. I remembered your name now, Darren. Now I looked at my phone. Sorry, mate. Um, and I've just bought, um, been drove about 120 mile and bought some really cool items off him. So if you want to take out his uh, Instagram page below, feel free, take a look, say hello. Um, um, so I've got some pretty cool items. This is the, the last of it. I've managed to squeeze it on the board. Um, one of the best things I got off him was this board. Um, he just cleared out shop fittings and all this wood came off it. He's a carpenter by trade and he's got a full woodworking setup like you see in the US. A massive big setup in a barn. So thank you for selling me this piece of wood, mate. Really appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, so we've got this tool haul of uh, pretty cool, interesting items. Um, so Nash Rathbone, you'll be pleased with this because um, there's uh, some footprints in this here to have a look at. Um, so without further ado, uh, let's get on. Um, it's got this Archimedes style um, screw, a little bit worse for wear condition, um, very, very wobbly head on it. But just look at that, it looks like a beehive of brass. I just absolutely love it with the wire. I just absolutely love it with the pin. It's missing, always seems to be missing the bit to somehow attach the pin, but that's a beauty. Well worth it. So I was really happy to pick that up. Um, let's move from this side. We've got this, um, looks to be in new old stock, um, seized up with neoprene and dirt, but looks to me to be new old stock. Domino um, wrench. With a broad arrow, 1945 domino. So that's a Nash Rathbone lump. We've got another um, broad arrow. This one's obviously someone's had a good carve with that one. So that's a shame. We've got the uh, Burston wrench with the spring, which is always nice. And um, Burston wrench, so that's a good one. British painting. We've got, this is another one. Was it War Force or something? Thumb turn, very, very cool, uh, number nine, made in England. Nash, have you ever, have you got one of these on your travels? Um, you're the uh, expert in these. Never seen that before. War force, made in England. Obviously, they didn't take off like the footprints because those are pretty common. Never seen one of those before. Quite a cool item. And the, the jaws look to be... I'm not sure if that's new old stock or not. It might have a slight bit of wear, but not much. Just mostly muck. 80 years of muck. Right, John, we're in our favourite word again. New old stock. We've got six of these in the neoprene, in the greaseproof paper. This one's kind of fell out with the paper. Um, these are um, Lucas Spanners. Um, very, very cool in the neoprene. So they're nice. Uh, six of those. We've got this German Hazard. Um, and I've sw I've got a Ghidorah one, which is identical to this. So this will clean up nicely. Why a um, bit of clean up? And then we'll get this, um, you know, nice and cleaned up. So I've got some serious cleaning to do over a while. We've got a Wolf for Finnish King Dick. Now I've been trying to buy a few King Dicks because there's a guy in Argentina who might be wanting a few of these, so I need to get, I need to keep buying these because I gave all mine away. We've got this NEC little um, adjustable uh, wrench, which is always nice and in quite good condition as well. We've got two miniature, which are quite unusual to find one, not two. Um, I don't know what that marking says there, some sort of stamp marking. But yeah, two uh, little King Dicks, so that's always fun. Get them cleaned up. Um, we've got these 1945, he had a whole box of these, new old stock. Um, um, I think they're for doing belts, you know, for putting the um, the loop through, not sure. Um, wadding punches, leather punches, nice ones. So I've not got any like that, so that was cool. Um, this little six inch Majobi, I'm um, not sure if that's been used. Yeah, I think that's been used, that's a, that's a used one, that. A little, a little uh, wrench, just says foreign on it probably German but I just like the handle it looks like a little belly like me so that was good we've got here um I think that's a it begins with W 
wolf or something, war for something. I, I remember it. I'm sure I've got one with a broken jaw. New old stock with the neoprene. I thought that was cool. And then we've got the little obligatory footprints. So we've got two of those little footprints, eh, Nash? Um, free running, just very, very dirty. And need a good clean up with the old 50-50. So that's the uh, little brother of that one there. So I thought that was fun. We've got three more. Um, 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 well, these two are Lucas's, but that one is a Shelly. So I've no, I don't think I've seen a Shelly one before. So we've got a Shelly and two Lucas's, which is cool. And then we've got three more King Dicks here. One, two, three. That one's a nice one. Um, that's a really nice one. I don't know what it says there. 1948 Air Ministry, King Dick. With the dog, new old stock, nothing, no damage on it. So that's a beautiful King Dick, that one. That might be a keeper. And then we've got this one, war finish, King Dick, and then this one. So three King Dicks, that one's my favourite out of those. So we got some pretty cool stuff, guys. I don't know if you agree. Um, it's always nice to pick up some uh, new old stock stuff. That's always a dream. You know, you no complaining there with new old stock, is there? Um, wadding punches are really cool. I've never seen one of those before. A war force. Uh, Nash will have to try them in. If anyone's got one, he'll have one. Um, and this Archimedes screw um, for a jeweler's like sort of drill for drilling. Um, you know, a little bit worse for wear, but still absolutely exquisite. You know how they carve that internally. I've no idea. Um, yeah, and then the little uh, little um, King Dicks as well. So some very, very, very cool items there indeed. Um, for, I don't know what you guys would pick for your favourite. I'm really struggling with this one. I really like that wrench. I, I always like that one. It's much nicer than the English um, Clyburn. It had a whole box of Clyburn number fours. I didn't buy those. I've got to draw a line somewhere. Um, I think I'm going to go for this Bent Archimedes drill. I just really, really like it. It's nice to see new old stock um, Lucas's as well. That's always nice to see. Yeah, so, yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty cool, cool items indeed there. Really enjoyed that. So um, put in the description which item you below. And don't forget, this is the guess the price one. So you need to put how much you think all of these items are gonna would cost. Um, all these items would cost in the uh, in the shop and um, so please do that and um, thanks for watching if you've watched all the five or six videos can't remember now how many there is I'm still in the middle of making them and um, thanks again um, all right take care bye